Welcome to the Eva blog. Part of the structure of ancient philosophies was the understanding of the necessity of passing on wisdom from one generation to another. And the further understanding that the new generation's responsibility was to add to that wisdom and knowledge with good character and pass it on to the subsequent generation in a snowballing effect of the accumulation of wisdom, knowledge, and proper behavior. A lot of that came from their elders, obviously. But you don't see that too often today. I was luckily one of those blessed with an exception to that current rule. My father was the wisest man I ever knew. And I thought it would be worthwhile to pass on some of his wisdom that he passed on to me, to you. And hopefully you'll be able to grow and add to that in your own life. Today, I'd like to talk about one of his favorite expressions, which was, if a thief knows that you work in a bank, they'll presume you steal. What does it mean? It's actually one of the most powerful and insightful tools or insights that my father ever bestowed upon me. What it means exactly is that all the people that you associate with and meet will view your behavior or actions or possible actions within the worldview and the value structure of their own. Hence, a thief, knowing that you work at a bank, automatically presumes you steal because that's what he or she would do. How does that benefit your life? Well, it's very important, I think, in retrospect, certainly, the kinds of people that you associate with, that you care for, that you do business with, etc. And one of the key ways of protecting yourself from their potentially bad character is to listen to their responses to some of your actions. Because their responses will indicate not necessarily what you did and why you did it, but in what they would have done and why they would have done it. And in listening to those responses and understanding whether or not they come with good character or bad character, you can go a long way towards deciding who you want to do business with, love, associate with, or simply share part of your life with. Until next time, love and blessings.